Actually, getting in the cadaver lab is so different from just sitting and looking at a textbook because it's one thing to, oh, go through a textbook and see it, but it's another thing to actually be in a body and see those muscles and be able to visualize them shortening and lengthening like they would when you're actually moving them. The cadaver lab, I think, is um, a unique experience because you get to work with like an actual human body and then you take out those brains and you use them for neuro. Um, and I think it's just a lot different than learning, seeing a body in a textbook, like a stereotypical body, because all bodies are different. Um, and then you get to learn and it helps you apply it in the classroom when you're learning about how to strengthen muscles, how to stretch muscles, and what their function actually is. I really enjoyed the Cadaver Lab. This is the first year in the program that we get to be in there. And so you're able to see um, not only like how muscles work, but um, the different, there's a lot of different bodies in there too, so we're able to see uh, some muscles are differently, the bigger, smaller, and different people, so um, it helps you to kind of visualize what muscles do as well. My standout experience would be um, being a teaching assistant in the cadaver lab. So when you're a first year student, you get to go into the cadaver lab and actually do the dissection, and then you have a few second year students that are teaching assistants that help the professor uh, answer questions and help with the dissection. Uh, so I applied to be a teaching assistant because I wanted to kind of give back to the program because my teaching assistants were so great and really aided in that learning experience. So I really wanted to give back and hopefully help the first year students as much as my second years helped me.